three. Now our current objective is to find the Baron's daughter in Oxenford, or Birdford, whatever. But we are in the big city, and I need to repair my armor. So better buy new ones. I usually just buy new ones. I've got like a thousand something. Death on three pounds of Yellow armor. Greetings. My, my, oh. Sure doesn't look like you. So, this. Looking to perfect. Of course. Still talking. Aye. Show me your wares. Show me. Show. What you got? You don't have my good armor here, but you got a good steel sword that I will buy. Yeah, actually. Um, sell. I'm not gonna sell you. You're my original with your sword. Sell, 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 and sell. So long. Um, you guys may not like this series, but I love this game. It's so well made. It's one of my this is my all-time favorite game of all time. one so we will switch her Rooney <coughs> I use the crossbow a lot when you're like swimming and stuff God, my voice is cracking up <coughs> I will cut out the witcher part or the witch part not the witcher part I'm looking for tomorrow the, the bloody baron's daughter nudity your brother said I'd so find her here Voitax sent you sir how else would I know she was here Wait a moment. I'll fetch her straight away. You do that. Whatever. <laughs> you're now. Yeah. To oh, there see it if is. you're still alive. Is. And well. I'm Geralt of Rivia. I'm quite alive and extraordinarily well, Geralt of Rivia. Better than I've ever been in this rotten life of mine. And now that you've seen me, I bid you farewell. Wait. We've nothing more to talk about. Got every right to be angry at your father, but he's worried about you. I have a right. Thank you kindly. So good to have the approval of his hired thug. And my father worries only about what to get soused on next. He's no saint, that's clear. But he's got the whole province on its feet looking for you. Finding you and your mother? Seems to me there's nothing more important to him now. I know evil men. He's not one of them. Shame he never showed such concern before. Especially for my mother. He made a mistake and knows that. I'm not defending him. Just saying that maybe he's come to realize what he's done. And what you mean to him. Oh, wonderful. I'll bear that in mind. Did you really come all the way here just to tell me that? Voitek claims your mother had strange marks on her hands, and that a monster dragged her into the woods. That true? We were riding towards the river. Suddenly, Mum cried out, bent over, almost fell off her horse. I rode up to her and saw something strange. Her hands were on fire, and then that creature leapt from the woods. I don't know what it was, but it roared so fierce my nose bled. I saw it topple trees. I've never been so scared in my life. And that... that... Thing grabbed my mum and disappeared into the woods. I wanted to turn back, go after them, but the, the horses panicked. Now I don't even know if she's alive. What will you do now? Find my mum. You realize that might not be that easy. Don't worry, I'm not daft enough to believe I can do it alone. I've got some new friends now. Powerful friends. 
Who are these friends, if it's not a secret? No secret. Heard of the Church of the Eternal Fire? A priest helped me contact the Redanian witch hunters. Righteous, brave men. They're Hence the candlesticks in your room. Once the heat of the... I hope it'll bless you with it. Thanks. Sorry, this is getting really boring for me. I hate the... What about your father? It's, it's been a really long conversation oh, in this him. game. I don't care. I won't go back to him. That bit of my life. Forgotten it already. Well, well. <laughs> a witcher. Never thought the Baron would stoop to hiring a monster slayer. Though I hear you're good at tracking things down. Glad and you know who, who I am. You supposed to be? introduced yourself, though. Graden, witch hunter in the service of His Royal Majesty Radovid of Redania. I'm certain you've rings come up a bell. Bell. If the bloody Baron sent, hope I get I to kill that guy in the end. He sounds like a real douchebag. As for Tamara, she can make her own decisions. Hmm. So the Baron. Where are you going to take her? Tamara must rest. She's had a harrowing experience. When the warmth of the eternal fire has restored her strength, we shall see about finding her mother. Hope you know what you're getting into. I've never been more certain. The eternal fire is the best thing that could happen to me. In that case, good luck. Thank you for respecting my choice. Farewell. Farewell you do. She seems like a nice lady. And that cat, that cat's pretty cool too. Nibbles. Cat name. Where does cat name I've ever seen? Talk to the Baron about. Defic. Okay, so I'll place a marker there. And you gotta go back there and then we can fast travel to the Baron's place. And uh. Talk to him and then I think we'll be done with that quest. For now. Sure. But <coughs> I know that <coughs> you don't complete the mission until like super later in the game. Cause you gotta like get every single person in the whole like, yeah interrogate everybody in the world that's powerful enough to be powerful. I'm bored. Let's travel here. Yep. Fast travels are way better in this game than, uh, what is it, uh, Fallout 4. Fallout 4 fast traveling takes fucking ages to do. Ages. I think, uh, Far Cry 4 is the same way. Takes forever to fast travel in that game. But this game is a lot faster, which I like. I love this game. It's so good. Wish you guys felt the same way, but probably don't. Because nobody watches these. But, hopefully, when I get up into a higher level, into a better place, I'll be able to show you what I mean. I don't know, this game took me forever to beat. That's why I'm doing it. Because it, uh,. Easy to beat. Remember me? Not really. It's really hard. Stable hand pulled you out of the fire. We'll never forget that. Here. I'm grateful. Oh, thank you, but there's only 20 here. <coughs> Whatever. Money's money. Uh, burpage. Damn, I forgot to get a Mountain Dew or a Pepsi from downstairs. Witcher, a word, please. What is it? What is it? That night when the Baron ordered everyone to lock their doors, stay inside. What did you and the Baron do? Gotta ask the Baron about that. Speaking of which, know where he is? Garden. Spends a lot of time sitting there of late. Drunk? No. Don't drink, don't eat. Just sit. Maybe he's trying to lose weight. You know? There you are. See the hollyhock there? The violet blooms. Brought the plants here from Nazaire. 
Anna had read some story, insisted on having them, spent hours tending to them, trimming, pruning. She was so content at that. And them, the frilly ones, are called birds of paradise in Zeracania. But Tamara called them dragons of paradise. She adored them. Damn shame I'll never learn which blooms would please Daya most. Oh, it's good to know her spirit's free. Got some information about your family. You've learned something? Well, let's go inside. It's a bit chilly out. Yep, it is. Mm, weird stuff. Any news for me? Your daughter's in Oxenford. What the blazes? Is she alright? In good health, safe. Why haven't you brought her back? She doesn't want to come back. To do that. How do you know she's safe? You see her at least. I saw her. We talked. She said I could tell you she's safe. When will she come home? And that she's not coming back. She's not to return. But I prepared all for her. Her rooms are white. I sent away for new pantoblas from Toussaint. How can she not come back? She's not coming back, period. And I don't blame her. I wouldn't want to return to a home like this either. Ah, horse bugger, you blind. I know what you think already. You've no need to repeat it. I've not been a good father, I know, but... Perhaps it's not too late. Can always try. Wouldn't count on succeeding, though. I've nothing to lose. Very well. You were to find them both. What of Anna? Learned anything? Nothing yet, but I'm on her trail. Well, what are you waiting for? For you to tell me about Siri, like we agreed. Yeah. <sighs> when Siri was on the mend, we took her out on a hunt. Thought a bit of galloping would warm up her limbs, gone stiff from so much bed rest. Yeah, yeah. No, no, this race is going to be pretty easy. That All races in this game are pretty pure easy. Pure luck in the flesh. To hunt down a wild boar that size. Why, worthy of one of King Faltest's feasts, were he still among the living. Sere, come! Our haunt should be yours as I see it. Oh, you done well, lass. Not bad. Not bad at all. But who goes boar hunting with a sword? No bow at hand, no spear. My sword was all I had. <laughs> well, you brandished it beautifully. Where'd they teach you that, anyway? At Kerr Morhen. Witcher school there, are you? But they only took lads, as I recall. They made an exception for me. Right. Me to say you're a she-witcher. Not entirely. The mutations, I was never subjected to them. But everything else I know, I learned from the witches there. Know any of them potions? Not so much. A bit. Because you see, at times I get this pinching back here. Shut it, Egrin. Nobody cares about your backside. A woman could swing a sword. I've knowed one. But never seen a lady mount anything but a cock proper. All tipsy on horseback. Nothing strange on account they bloody mount them sideways. What? Perhaps you'd care to wager. Think you can outrun me on an horse? <laughs> Naturally. What's I mean a horse, stake? not an horse. Black mare. Jesus. The one in the stable. Oh, that won't do at all. What happened? You get the jitters? No. <laughs> so why not? The horse is mine. To race the Baron himself. I'd consider it an honor. <laughs> oh, that'd be a sight to behold. Would it ever? Done. But if I win... I take your sword. Agreed. I'd not drink any more this night. You want your head about you? We 
started daybreak. 